of Grand Theft Auto 3. I am so excited and I'm gonna turn the light off behind me because it's distracting. Don't mind the background voice, that's my fiance being weird. <laughs> hey! Now we're I love this theme. Just for the first broadcast, I'm actually gonna leave it on. You know, all of the Grand Theft Auto themes have actually been crucial to like the series. It, it's just part of the identity of the whole thing. But the, this, for the first one, is very good. Like, it's up there. Let us begin. Dizzy, man. Sorry, babe. I'm an ambitious girl. You're just small time. Hello. Actually, have, have the three set of cheeks pulled out. As the police and emergency services deal with the mm. of a devastating attack on a police convoy Wait. this morning. As Money, health, no and weapons. About the prisoners being transferred in the convoy, and no group has claimed responsibility. The convoy left police headquarters early this morning for a routine transfer of felons to Liberty Penitentiary. The attack took place on the Callahan Bridge, leaving few witnesses, and the bridge itself severely damaged. Some of the convicts are thought to have perished in the explosion that followed the initial attack. Revelations as to the professionalism of the attack struck police hours afterward, when identification of the missing felons were further hampered by an attack by computer hackers on police headquarter databases. With the Porter Tunnel Project falling behind schedule, this disaster leaves Portland isolated from the rest of the city. Your dickhead. It's no problem to kill you. You're gonna be sorry. Aye, aye, get lost. Hey, Raul, how you doing? I 
I know a place on the edge of the red light district where we can lay low. But my hands are all messed up, so you better drive, brother. Oh, I'm in. All right. Let's do a bit of... Wow, this menu is so odd. Okay, we're gonna lower the music volume. Delight you with tales of the Black Death, witch burnings, and the joys of being a feudal sir. Forget about air conditioning and modern medicine. We've got all the leeches, spells, and potions you need at the Medieval Millennium Fair. Okay, brightness, trails, no trails, widescreen, uh, sure, subtitles, yep. Okay, controls were good. Oh, vibration. Yeah, sure. Hey. Briefs. Love briefs. Stats. Nothing. Good. Alright, let's put in some cheats, man. Alright, we got... What do we got? We got get all weapons. R2, R2, R1, R2. Yeah, we're good. Alright. More money. R2, R2, R1. I wish every Grand Theft Auto had a money cheat. <laughs> like, I don't know, it's so sad to me that, like, modern Grand Theft Autos didn't have as many cheats, you know? Or, if you think about Grand Theft Auto after, like, 2009, it's like, oh, if you put in cheats, like, you're gonna get whatever, like, you can get, like, achievements or something. It's like, don't put achievements in the first place, then, like, I'm not gonna give a crap anyways. <laughs> Like, it's so cool to just have the power to do this. Like, now I have this rifle that I couldn't have had it right at the beginning of the game. Okay, full armor, R2, R2, R1, R2. Nice. Now I have... R2, No. Dun, 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 dun. No, wait. Wow. Wait! Double cleft! Wow, you're learning some real skills. How about the salary and benefits? Oh, I'm in. sorry. See, that's the kind of dedication we have to our employees and the You know, as much as I love Vice City and like... Always running. Also San Andreas, of course. I love the cars in this game. ...comes from Dante's Inferno, originally transcribed in Braille to a chaste Belgian monk after he lost his hearing. This powerful feud can overpower the senses, much like a 12-year-old nephew who lets you bounce him on your knee one last time. Moto Adagio. Yeah, I think like, I feel like Double Clef is the only radio station I can put on ever because it's classical music. This is the place right here. Let's get off the street and find a change of clothes. Also, it's it's a little screwed up that like when you're listening to classical music, you're like killing people. So I dig it. I know this guy. He's connected. His name is Luigi. Me and him go back, so I could probably get you some work. Come on, let's head over. Luigi. Where's Mario at? Wait here, man, while I go in and talk to Luigi.
say hello to Eight Ball, lady. Eight Ball's got some business upstairs. Well, maybe you could do me a favor. One of my girls needs a ride, so grab a car and pick up Misty from the clinic, then bring her back here. Remember, no one messes with my girls. So keep your hands on the wheel. If you don't mess this up, maybe there'll be more work for you. Now get out of here. Now get out of here. <laughs> It's so funny how you can have a rocket launcher and a flamethrower. <laughs> yeah, right? When in reality I have 225... No, wait. 2.2 million dollars right now. Because of the money cheat. Yeah, this game didn't really have many that many weapons, I don't think. Like. Also, no motorcycles. Luigi said no motorcycles to, or to choppers. This, so Only like the here, police chopper, here, but you, you can't take it. There's a new high on the street. Goes by the name of Spank. Some wise guy's been introducing this trash to my girls down Portland Harbor. Go and introduce a bat to his face. Then take his car, respray it. I want compensation for this insult. Spank, nice. Also, I, I always found it interesting how the protagonist in this game never talks. I already had the bad, but okay. Would you like a kid? I wonder. Please, Aris, mod. God, I forgot you can't take a look at the map in this game at all like you can only see the mini map but you can't see the overall map that's one of the difficult aspects of this game you have to guess where to turn you have to like memorize where stuff is Yeah, no map. That was introduced in Vice City. Because I was gonna look for the best route to take or move to like get to where I have to go now and you know. So when there's a time limit of where to go, then it's like it's a real challenge. Hey, how you doing buddy? This is gonna be a one-two combo. Oh! Ah! 
Wait. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, I have to really memorize the controllers in this one. The controls. That's pretty cool. Oh, come on. I would love to see in front of me, though. the best camera here. Well, I'm on foot though, it's too close. playing Spider-Man, there wasn't really a display of how good I drive, but in this game, you can see, I'm like a flawless driver. the space so exact that's funny that it's mm. uh, it has this camera too you can fail the seven seeds. this is the way like Grand Theft Auto used to that's look sexy, like the original games it's an interesting perspective oh, did this guy get tired already damn you gotta work on your cardio man What's up, Cab? I'm gonna need this right quick. talk to you. All right, Mick, I'll talk to you later. How you doing, kid? The Don's son, Joey Leone. He wants some action from his regular girl, Misty. Go pick her up at Hepburn Heights, but watch yourself. That's Diablo turf. Then run her over to his garage in Trenton and make it quick. Joey ain't the kind you keep waiting. Remember, this is your foot in the door. So keep your eyes on the road and off Misty. version of it like with a map. But nope. Alright. You walk a regular for Luigi now, huh? It's about how we got a driver we can trust.
I'll be with you in a minute, Spark Plug. I bought the three Grand hey, Theft Autos from from the PlayStation right. online store. They came in a bundle. Like GTA 3, GTA San Andreas, and uh, Vice City. Hey, I'm bored. When are you gonna drill me? In a moment, sweetheart. I got a little business to take care of. I got a little job for you, pal. The Ferrelli brothers have owed me money for too long and they need to be taught some respect. Lips Ferrelli is stuffing his fat face in the St. Mark's Bistro, so steal his car and take it to Eight Ball's bomb shop up in Harwood. You know Eight Ball, right? Once he's fitted it with a bomb, go park the car where you found it. Then sit back and watch the whole show. But hurry up, he won't be in forever. Six minutes, great. Just so I'm getting acquainted with the map. Time limits suck. It's funny how back in the day a map like this one seemed like huge. But nowadays it's like a map like this is rather tiny. this vehicle or else I have to go and respray it home. Wait. Bomb armed. Here I go. Goodbye. That's so funny, eat till you explode, come on. Nice, 10 grand for blowing up a guy. Oh, what? What? Who do you think you are? Get it. This, this Liberty City is very violent. <laughs> it's just like somebody standing on the street. Oh, I better kick his ass. Whoa. Sorry. Some Diablo scumbag has been pimping his scuzzy bitches in my backyard. Go and take care of things for me. If you need a piece, Go around back of ammunition opposite the subway. 
he definitely didn't say ammunition. Ammunition. He said I'm donation. Well, what do I know? English is my second language. Alright. guys that's so funny that little jingle so awesome back when this game came out this would have been like revolutionary everything that I'm doing all the experience from the newer games. <laughs> held at the old school hall near the Callahan Bridge and they'll be looking for some old school action. Now I got girls all over town walking the street. Get them to the ball. They'll make a bundle. Get as many of them as you can before the cops freak away their green. Again, I don't know if I mentioned this, but I find it so interesting how the main character of this game never talks. It's so funny how in this game they say girls and in San Andreas they just say oh. <laughs> I guess Rockstar was te testing the grounds to see what they could get away with in this game by city and then in San Andreas they just didn't care.
accelerating backwards. It's physically impossible, but that's okay. Right. This game predates 2005, so... I guess it's also cool that the map doesn't have that many layers to it, so I guess a bigger map, you could work without it. Alright, got them all. Ooh. Jeez. I love this <laughs> squishing noise of pedestrians when I run them over. It sounds like a grapefruit. <laughs> Squish. <laughs> Squish. Chunky Lee Chong is pushing spank for some new gang from Colombia or Colorado or something. Colombia, I'm, really I'm sure from there. Details. Anyway, he's got a noodle stand down in Chinatown. That rat has sold his last stir fry. I want you to take him out. If you need a piece, go around back of ammunition opposite the subway. Sort yourself with a nine. You know where it is, right? Well, remember, just watch your back in Chinatown. It's triad territory. That guy's eyes are so blue. should save given the fact that I have so much ammo on me and I've beaten a lot of missions. Then again I am playing on PS4 so if I turn it off it's like uh no progress will really be lost. I'll just pick up where I left off. But so derpily. Hey, what's good, guys? I have like 20,000 guns and 30,000 bullets. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Alright, here we go. About to get violent. I suggest y'all run away. Hey, where are you going? Come on, man. Ah. Uh. Can't lose them. If I lose them, I lose the mission. I think. Oh, okay, I'm gonna have to steal this car. Yo, give me that, Granny. Hey. Oh, shoot. Let's clean out of here. All right. I guess the number of missions we did today is cool. Yeah. Right. He got away. And then it got all foggy all of a sudden. Yo, the weather is whack. Why do they show it like this? It's just like, oh no, it's rainy or it's overcast. No, it's just a cloud. Chunky Lee Chong. You guys are so on the nose with the names. All right, let's get his ass. Okay, I 
guess the first move should be to blow up this car. I guess setting it on fire works too. All right, we're gonna hit the payroll van. It leaves the edge of Chinatown every day. Bullets won't even dent the van's armor, so get a car and ram it off the road. Now hit it hard, and the punk-ass security guard should bail. Then take it to the warehouse at the docks, and my guys are gonna take over from there. Now it won't be doing its rounds all day, so don't hang around. Cool, boss. Here I go, I guess. All the stars go away now. I don't want to be dealing with cops. Oh my god, I am going to be dealing with cops. Shit. Oh man, I have to look up the cop sheet, man. Uh. Cause riot. Normal weather. Raise wanted. Wanted level down. Okay, we're good. Clear. Okay, guys, if you let me uh, borrow your car for a second. Oh, could you not dive into my car? You are an idiot. Uh, I forget what I have to do, by the way. So, let's look at the brief. Okay, bullets won't even dent the van's armor, so get a car and ram it off the road. Hit it hard. So the guards should bail. Take it to the warehouse. Okay, cool. So I literally have to steal the thing.
Okay, cool. Okay, let's see if I remember this correctly. That's not good. Oh dear. Can you guys please just leave me alone? I just need to beat this mission. I wish you could buy more things in this game other than like weapons. I don't need hey, I, weapons. I just have a crap ton of money now. Hey, don't mess with me! Ah! the guy I was telling you about. All right, listen, this guy, he ain't Italian, and he's no mechanic, but he could get things fixed. This is Pop's capo, Tony Cipriani. Hey, I'm Tony Cipriani. Take him to Mama's restaurant at St. Mark's, all right? Now, listen hey, to me. I'm planning I can't remember Tony Cipriani driver, from so Liberty City Stories. Later, okay? Okay, kid, drive me to the laundry in Chinatown first. I got a bit of business to take care of. Those washerwomen ain't been paying their protection money. And watch the car. Joey just fixed this junk heap. So no fancy crap, okay? But on Wednesday afternoon, I meet Barbara. Wait here. Keep the engine running. This ain't a social call. Is he gonna break the windows? Oh. Automatic doors. Fancy. Oh my god. How's he still alive? They shot him like five times. It's a triad ambush! Get us out of here, kid! I got you, boss man. I got you. No need to worry. Wanna be done for the old? I got you. Yeah, you play as him in Liberty City Stories. That's funny. Because Liberty City Stories and Vice City Stories are prequels to these games. To Vice City and Grand Theft Auto 3. It's a shame that they never came out with like San Andreas stories. That game would have been the shit. For like the PSP or something. The Triads think they can mess with me. The Triads. With me. Drop by later and we'll give them something to launder. Their own blood-stained clothes. Damn. Tony made a lot of weight since Liberty City Stories. Finish G. 
these missions first. Beautiful, just beautiful. All right, just the guy I need to talk to. All right, there's a car stuffed with a stiff at the cafe near Callahan Point. One of the Ferrellis thought he was a wise guy, so he got what he had coming to him. Take the corpse to the crusher in Harwood, all right? landing. I even earned a trophy, that's awesome. anyways. Oh my god. I can't run and leave. I've actually stayed inside a vehicle when it did that, I think in, in Liberty City Stories, obviously. And then it just crushed me inside. It's okay. Six and fourteen. Ah, oh, okay. I guess I could save. I have, I have a fast car. Showing these big ass cars. Oh! 
I was just waiting for like a contract to show up or something. But this guy came first, so. Right, she's gonna be, huh? All right, listen. Get some wheels to the safe house at St. Mark's and pick up a few friends of mine. They're hitting the bank and they need a driver. I gave my word that you were the man, so don't screw this up. Get them to the bank before five o'clock, not a minute after. Stop hitting me. Yo, I'm taking your car. Nope. Oh my god. Wow. He just kept rolling. That was incredible. Yeah, I love cop cars in this game because they're so, so fast. Nope. Oh, that's not good. Yay. Yay. Okay. Two or two, L one or two. Okay, R two or two, L one or two. Here we go. Garden party. Yeah, has emerged as the fastest nice. growing U.S. run media conglomerate of the past five years. Enough seats, got you. Um, that car! Yo, get out of there. Nope, nope, nope. Almost ran over that now, but that's okay. And that cop car just disappeared. I don't know it. Okay. <laughs> get us to the bank on the main drag. They need 
sardines. Keep the engine running. We'll be in and out in no time. It's so funny how they were doing heists even from back then. You know, Rockstar was actually planning on incorporating some oh, sort of like multiplayer mode from this game. Oh my god. How did you guys get this much heat in two seconds? I'm the first. Yeah, multiplayer would have looked like some sort of primitive Halo type of thing combined with whatever Grand Theft Auto 4's multiplayer was, but with these graphics. So it would have been a little whack. Oh my god, really? Yeah. It's always been debated, like, co op for these games would be great. Taking out the laundry. Take a seat, kid. Make sure you separate Take the colors from seat. the whites. So the laundry won't pay any protection, huh? The triads think they can mess with me? Let's teach these would-be tough guys what it means yeah. to be a tough guy. Teach them some respect. No son of mine gets to buy some triads. God father, God sorry, rest Ma. his soul, took no crap from those triads. Yes, Ma. Italy. I want you to destroy really their funny. laundry vans and mangle any triad gimp that gets in your way. Eight Ball can supply you with what you're gonna need. Off my 
Republican people bleed. Or trying to, he'll never be as tough as his pop. But he left you a note on the table. The laundry has agreed to pay. You did real good, kid. Go collect the cash and bring it back here. Watch out for the triads. They may be shoving a firecracker up your ass. But don't take no crap. Nobody, I mean nobody, messes with Tony Cipriani. Oh, Cipriani. All right. It's not Cipriani. Apologies to all Italian people. Oh my god. Yo. These cop cars I keep running into are just insane. Oh, there they come. Oh, could be a thousand guys. I don't care. Be a lucky right, here we go. Oh, I was gonna light him up. Are you really going all the way around? Don Salvatore has called a meeting. I need you to collect the limo and his boy Joey from the garage. Then get Luigi from his club. Come back here and pick me up. Then we'll all drive over to the boss's place together. Those triads, they don't know when to stop. They want a war, they got a war. Now get going. It's really funny how Vice City is basically Scarface the video game. This is basically Goodfellas the video game. heavy part of like Rockstar's success in the beginning because of these three games. Like San Andreas has its own little set of references. But between Vice City and Red Cloud 3 it's like the classics of all the mob movies. Oh. 
Yeah, right. How you doing, kid? How you doing? No fancy crap. Oh, what? Oh, what is happening now, man? Oh, oh my god. Yo, driving a limo in this weather conditions, these weather conditions is terrible. All in itself. Now I have three trucks and people shooting at me. And oh my god. That makes it well, there I go. I have to get back in the vehicle. No, get in. Oh my god. Wow, this is a little bit annoying. <laughs> no, no, get out. Okay, here we go. I'm Morgan Merriweather, but please. Go faster, go faster, go faster, go faster. Yo, this is gonna like light up in flames and flames. so many. Oh, it's so close. Oh my god. Damn it. <laughs> oh, I'm so good. <laughs> oh my god. I was so close. Oh god. Alright. I know my health is displayed in orange. Yeah, remember the cab in uh, my city? That thing was a lifesaver. Here, you don't get that. Go do this meeting, man. Hey, 
I don't Two requirements to be good at this game, these games, the early on versions of them. Are you a good driver? Can you kill people? That's it. Come on, man, let's get into the car a little faster here. Jeez, it's only 20 years. No fancy crap. Yeah, no fancy crap. I'm about to go belly up like it says there. Oh my. this again. Let's just try to go through. Yo, chill out. I go into that water. I'm done. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Oh. This is the last mission that you played? That's funny. This is the first time I'm here. Because I haven't played this game you did good back all the way there, through kid. ever. Real good. Come on, let's introduce you to the Don. Hey, Luigi. Oh, my girls have been missing hey, you so Luigi. long, Salvatore. You've been away too you long. You tell them once this unfortunate business is taken care of, we'll all go down to the club and celebrate, okay? There's my boy. How you doing, Pop? You got yourself a good woman yet? Hey. Your mother, God bless her soul, would be turning over in her grave to see you without a wife. I know, Pop. I'm working on it. Tony! Working on How's your off. mama? She's Kinder's a great woman, you know. Strong. Firenze. She's good. Firenze. Right. Terrific, terrific. Now listen, you guys, you go inside while I talk to our new friend here. I see nothing but good things for you, my boy. Okay, so all I had to do was get him alive here, and then I started working for Salvatore. Chaperone. Look at that. Another driving mission. Talk business, so you're gonna look after my girl for the evening. Hey, Maria! Move your butt! Dumb bro does this every time. And here she is, the one and only Queen of Sheba. What were you doing up there? Whatever it was, I bet it cost me money. Well, you don't think I hang around here for the conversation, do you? Get in the car! 
And keep your big mouth shut. Take the limo, but bring it back in one piece, you hear me? And watch her. She can be trouble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure you knew Lap Dog has everything covered. And isn't he big and strong? Hey, Fighter, let's go visit Chico and get some party treats. He's at the rail station at the Chinatown waterfront, I think. Yeah, show me the music, guys. Come on. I'm gonna get hit with a copyright notice tomorrow morning. Especially since you have this game on mobile, I can't imagine. I also can't imagine doing this without like the cheats. I need the cheats. They're like a vital component of this whole experience. I can't get a limo, can I? Nope. Get back into the stretch. Jeez. Chico. Ah, mira, it's my favorite lady. You're looking for some fun? A little, mm, some spank? Hey, Chico. Nah, just the usual. Are you using the phone with that husband? Hey, maybe you should check out the warehouse party at the East End of Atlanta Keys. Mm, thanks, Chico. See you around. Gracias. And enjoy. That's good stuff. It looks like they're doing sign language. <laughs> Come on, Fred. Let's go and check out this. Yeah, I'm guessing it's the style of like animating. Four five to all units. This is Sankara Creative Panic Suite. Now what? Oh, raid! Great, it's the party. It's a raid. You're gonna die. Oh, I can see it's a police raid. I'm gonna stay in the limo. Have a beer. Watch this whole thing go down. Maria, just get in the vehicle, I'll get you back. man that with a way of coding how characters moved it's just 
been so you know, I enjoyed developed myself for the first time in a long while. In the past, like, you know, 10 you years. You treat me really good. Even. Respect and everything. Oh, I better go. Games are just I'll so different. You around, I hope. Much better. Even with, like, Spider-Man, you, like, some of the AI looks, like, a little derpy, but, like, most of it controls pretty well. Cutting the grass. Oh, that's a little bit on the nose. Leave us alone for a minute. The Colombian cartel is making spank somewhere in Liberty, but we don't know where. And they seem to know everything we're doing before we do. We got us a rat. There's a guy named Curly Bob, works the bar at Luigi's. He's been throwing more money around than he's earning. He ain't pimping or pushing, so he must be talking. He usually gets a taxi home after work, so follow him. And if he's ratting us out, kill him. <laughs> Have a good evening. I love you too. Yeah, Curly Bob. Great name. Take him so seriously. Such a threat. Beware of Curly Bob. Yeah, that's my fiance. Don't worry, not your bed. Sucks. Okay. I mean, if I got my car stolen like that, man. Oh, uh, yeah. I don't know, man. I wanted to do the whole, like... Like, you know how there's all the Harry Potter movies, you do, like, uh, a marathon of them, or, like, Lord of the Rings? For Assassin's Creed, there's so many Assassin's Creed games, I wanted to, like, beat each of them one by one. I got through, like, 70% of the very first Assassin's Creed, and then I'm like, I'm almost there. And then I played some missions of the second Assassin's Creed, and I really liked it, but then I just kind of fell off the wheel. Like, I'm like, no, I can't, I can't do this, this is too much. And then I've played, like, other Assassin's Creed games. I basically own all of the Assassin's Creed games, except for the newest one. But I just couldn't do it. Mr. Big Mouth himself. Were you followed? You know what goes on here is our little secret, I mean. No, no, I, I wasn't followed. You got my stuff? Here's no, I wasn't followed. Scoot. Now talk. Okay, so the Leones are fighting wars yeah, on two fronts. Yeah, apparently Ed's They're in the turf war with like the triads, the with no sign of either side giving up. Meanwhile, Joey Leone has stirred up some bad blood with the Forellis. Every day they're losing men and influence in the city. Salvatore is becoming dangerous and paranoid. He expects everybody and everything. And with loyalty like yours, nice. what has he possibly got to worry about? Whack Curly Bob. That could be a trending hashtag on Twitter. Hashtag whack curly ball. There he is running. That was so hard. That's probably the most difficult mission of this game.
Yeah, sometimes. Right, let's go with Tony. What you got for me, Tony? Love We're at war. The Triads have a fish factory as a front. Most of their business goes down at the fish market in Chinatown. The laundry still owes us protection. They reckon the Triads are protecting them now, so I say we exact a fitting punishment. Take those boys over and whack the Triad warlords. Hell, if you get a chance, pop some of their yeah, soldiers too. Yeah, I saw too. a couple of trailers for Black Ops 4. Looks like an alright game. It's not like I'm gonna play it though. Don't really do the whole first person shooter thing. I shouldn't say that, I love Halo. Um Yeah, exactly. Red Dead Redemption 2 is where it's at for October. <laughs> but you can see they're like trying so hard to sell uh, Black Ops. Like they they're doing a battle royale mode, they're doing zombies, they're doing everything. And I'm like, guys, how about you just take like a couple of years off, make a good game, and then release it. Like, how about you do that? Because it worked for Black Ops 1. Black Ops 1 was such a good game. But apparently Black Ops 2 was too as well. For me I guess not so much. For other people, they're like, yeah, man, Black Ops 2 is where's that? Where is that? Nothing else came. I didn't really give a shit after Black Ops 4. Dude, it's like a war zone out here. God damn. Why don't the police step in? But yeah, so Red Dead Redemption 2. Apparently, as I've seen, yeah, Modern Warfare was like where some people capped it too. Actually, I shouldn't say that, like, because wait, try it, fish man. Am I gonna find that just in the middle of nowhere? Or everywhere? Because I did play um, Call of Duty World War II. That game was great. It was really well made, thought out, like they finally gave the fans what they wanted, so I'm like, you know what? I'm all in. I like this. Go back to your roots. Kinda like the way Lego almost went bankrupt in the early 2000s and they then they went back to what they do best and they're one of the most successful toy companies if not the most successful toy that manufacturer in the world oh my god yeah this guy sucks all right buddy oh. okay my guys will take care of you i guess but if they don't goodbye Because what ended up happening was, with the first person shooters, Battlefield 1 came out, and then Call of Duty's like, whoa, that actually works. And then they were like, we need to step it up. So they came out with World War II. And I'm like, yo, this is like the original Call of Duty games that like we grew up to love. And now Battlefield's jumping on the World War II bandwagon, so I guess that'll go well for them. Hidden package, that's cool. Oh, we're good. 
Okay, perfect. Crowbat? No, I have not. Is that where you get your gaming news from? <laughs> I get mine from Game Ranks. <laughs> Excuse me, another sec. Oh my god, what? Great. I don't know why the alarm's on. But it's pretty annoying. Come on. Okay, there we go. But no, I've never heard of Crobat. What is Corbett like funny or informative? Okay, I've had what enough of do? this shit. We're gonna finish the triads and liberty once and for all. Eight balls rigged a dust cart with a bomb. It's on a timer. So if you mess up, there'll be no evidence. Go and pick up the dust cart. Careful. Eight ball says it's real sensitive. And the slightest bump could set that thing off. Their fish factory will open its gates for a dust cart. So you can drive right in. Park up between the gas canisters and get the hell out of there. I want it to rain mackerel. We're talking real biblical here. Nothing low budget. Yeah, great. Trash Master, is that what it's called here? Oh yeah. So problem number one of this mission, the car is huge and slow. Problem number two, there's a timer. Problem number three, if it takes any damage, the bomb will be set off. Oh, great. I don't even know how far away I am from the target. I'm just gonna keep driving. Hopefully I don't mess this up and blow myself up. But at least it's not raining. Because if it were, this thing would be slippery as hell. And also, at least the cops are not chasing me. So that's a plus. Up, senor, I'm here to pick up the trash. Yo, could you could you not cross right where I'm about to like blow up the freaking We're good, we're good, we're good. We're perfect. 30 seconds. Okay, I'm good. Bomb's not set. Oh, God. Bomb's armed. Bye-bye. Goodbye. Goodbye. I'm out. This whole thing is going to be level. Well, there goes that. Yeah, 
Yeah, let me out. Jeez. Grab that van. I don't know why they didn't allow for people to swim in Grand Theft Auto 3 or Vice City. Like, was the coding too difficult for these characters to, characters to swim? Like, why is it that you just step into the water and you die? I don't get it. Bomb the base, Act 1. Oh the God. cartel has got bottomless funds from pushing that spank crap. If we make an open attack on them, they'll wipe the floor with us. They must be making spank on that big boat that Curly led you to. So we gotta use our heads. Or rather, one head. Your head. I'm asking you to destroy that spank factory as a personal favor to me, Salvatore Leon. If you do this for me, you will be a made man. Anything you want. Go and see 8-Ball. You'll need his expertise to blow up that boat. I'll be a made man. I've driven you guys everywhere. I've been your personal limo driver, your personal killing machine. Now I'll be a made man. That sounds good. That sounds good to me. Let's go. Let's get made. Yeah, right? Let's be a made man. Act two. Yo, my man, Salvatore phoned ahead, but a job like this is gonna need a lot of fireworks. I'll need a hundred thousand dollars to Wayans cover expenses. From but you know with me, dream. you get a lot of bang for your buck. Come back, brother, when you have the money. Come back when I have the money. I have all the money in the world. We're good. Okay, let's do this then. I can Those set this hysterical. baby to detonate, but I still can't use a piece with these hands. Here, this rifle shall help you pop some heads. I have all the weapons I need, bro. I, okay. Sure. Press and hold the R1. Zoom. Zoom out. Sounds good. Here's how you use a sniper rifle.
Get a good vantage point, then I'll head in when you fire the first shot. I should just go in, guns blazing, take everybody out. Make it clean, simple. But they want me to do it sneakily with a sniper rifle. Sure, man. That's so funny, that's right next to where the guys are. How can they not see me? Oh, I gotta go up even more. Okay, I'm good, I think. Oh, I hate how it's inverted. Why is it inverted? Controls. Vibration, yes. Mm. So I'm guessing you can't uninvert it. So it's just permanently inverted. Setup one. Setup two. So weird. No, I'm guessing setup one is fine. Uh, uh that sucks. Okay. All right, we're just gonna have to deal with it. It's gonna be inverted. Oh, the guy's heads don't explode. That's lame. Whoa. How did that guy get iced? Also, how did I run out of ammo given the fact that I've like done the cheat code so many times? Oh, I don't get a rifle. Oh my god. I forgot. Yo, chill. Oh my god. Okay. I didn't lose that much health. <laughs> ah, this is gonna be one of those protect the other guy missions. That sucks. Bitch in that food. A good boy. Just kidding, I don't have a dog, I wish I did. Yeah, these kind of missions are annoying. Dude, I think I should definitely do like the medic and the vigilante missions s now or soon, given the fact that like the rest of the map isn't open and you couldn't possibly get people to kill or patients in the other sections of the map, so they're much easier. Okay, let's Yay, do this Nate. then. I can set this baby to detonate, but I still can't use a piece with these hands. Here, this rifle shall help you pop some heads. Okay, whether I beat this mission or not, I think I'm gonna give it a try with like a vigilante mission. Uh, I think you get 50 extra armor in this game for those missions too. Gonna move a bit quicker, come on man. I also don't know how I feel about the fact that in the newer Grand Theft Autos you you can't really do like 
vigilante missions and stuff and unlock like more health and stuff. Like I feel like that was part of the charm of these games. There's many things I wouldn't change about Grand Theft Auto. Like if we got a revamping of these games with like, I guess today's graphics, like not today's physics, it would look great. Like yeah, there's still like a cool thing like throwback wise and like nostalgia and the whole thing, but these games are so great. Like in essence, at the core, these games are fantastic get a good vantage point then I'll head in when you fire the first shot all right let's go bro come on I know I know what to do I already failed this mission once can I just get it from here cuz like I don't really want to go all the way up there I think I have to Alright, there's my man 8-Ball. He's right in front of, like, four explosive barrels. Why, bro? Why are you there? Okay, there's nobody there. There's these guys here, so I guess I should take care of them first. Come on, come on. There we go. Nice. Alright, you got it? Okay, don't keep going. Damn it, he kept going. Nice. Okay. Son of a bitch. Paramedic gives me infinite stamina. Nice. That's what I thought. Oh, alright. I guess it's time to, like, wreak havoc across the city and stop doing the missions. For now. Let's do some vigilante missions and some paramedic missions. Tonight. How can you get more health? Like 150 health. How do I do that? Is there another like pizza delivery missions like in Vice City? Let's see how hard these missions are. Oh god. Let's start with paramedic. Drive the patients carefully. We got this. Hey man, you've been shot. This screws me up because I don't know where these people are. Yo, yo, what is the ambulance doing right now, man? Yo, no, come on. Can you flip? Oh, I need this thing to flip. 
Nah, no, I'm screwed. Tell us about it. It's fine. Oh, wow. That really sucked. How did the ambulance do that? <coughs> Jesus. Alright. Alright. Yep, I'm gonna need your vehicle real quick. Let's, let's try that again, shall we? And if I fail, I'll just spawn the freaking. Maybe we can increase max. You can't increase max health in this game? gotta be able to. Also, where did the hospital go? It was right there. I'm definitely going the wrong way. Oh, it's right here. Yep. Got him. Perfect. Alright. Let's try this again. Boom. Behind me. 50 seconds. I think you can increase health, I just don't know how, because in Vice City it's like, alright, yeah, go deliver the pizzas, you'll be fine, but in this one it's like, is there a pizza delivery mission? Same thing we did last time. Oh god. How is this car so unstable? So we're gonna do the following. We're gonna loop around here so I don't have to go back and forth. Go on, I hear it! <laughs> like if I turn too fast, the car's just gonna tip over. Nice. Oh, 28 seconds. Yeah, that's what I read. I don't know if I can do that on a stream without getting flagged, though. <laughs> because that's kind of inappropriate, even though the whole game is inappropriate. But, uh, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, other than that, there has to be another way to increase my health in this game. <laughs> not about to like pick up a prostitute in the game and be like oh my god what is he doing it's like chill out guys this is like 10 years old no not more than that this game is like this game's gonna be like 18 years old soon let's get it <laughs> 20 seconds yo who set the timer Get in, get in, get in, get in. Nice. That timer's like way off. You can't pick up that many people in that little time. Oh, nice. Yo, this game blows. This mission, I mean, this game's awesome, but the, this mission sucks. Nine seconds to get them all carefully in there? One minute. I wonder what level I have to be to, like, get the reward. Although, infinite sprinting in this game would really help out. This guy can't run a block for shit. Yo, 
Yeah, I guess it's the same as Vice City, but I guess we'll find out. Oh, come on. Why? Why did it do that? Like, really? That's just... No, nah, I'm out. Bye-bye. Burn in there. It's okay. R.I.P. What a ginormous waste of time. Yo, these guys... Don't know who you're messing with. Nope, oh, took out. Oh wow, this camera is horrible. Okay, here we go. Get that guy! Oh god. Wow. <laughs> I almost stopped the broadcast by accident. <laughs> Alright. Um. The tank. Yo, chill. Alright, I think I might just like spawn the tank and leave it there. It's been two hours. Wow, exactly two hours of this stream. So give me a second. Nope, not there. Nope, not there. Get the tank. Okay, here we go. Yo, screw off. You feel lucky, Pop? And the wheeler by uh oh is. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. R1, L2, L1, Oh, nice. There it is. You are risky, police! I love how I wasn't even looking. Tune in tomorrow or whatever next week. No, not next week. Definitely tomorrow. <laughs> um, but I'm exhausted. It is almost midnight where I'm at, so I'm gonna call it quits. Thank you for joining me in my broadcast. Hopefully you join tomorrow. That was Grand Theft Auto 3. I beat like so many freaking missions. I can't even. I didn't even keep track. I went through like five different names <laughs> of like people that I beat missions for. So or with or whatever. You get it. I'll keep playing this game, definitely. So fun, so hard, so old. Definitely a throwback. So, you guys keep being you. I'll be here. Have a good night. Good night, Raul, my man. <laughs>